In the following example, we will show you a little bit more about the new SIA Engineer to Tecla Structures link. This link is based upon a new API, .NET API, which is available as of version 15 of Tecla Structures. This link also requires SIA Engineer 2010. The example that we are going to show you is just a very basic example built up out of 1D prismatic members. As you can see, the beams in this example are all hot rolled sections. The model consists of the three different cross sections EPE 400, EPE 100, and HE 240A for the columns. To export this model into Tecla structures, you just go into File, Export, Export Tecla file. Specify the place and the name of the file, and the first step is done. The new Tecla link uses a very specific plugin. This plugin can be found under the CIA in engineer installation folder and uses a file format called S2T SIA to Tegla. Once you launch the plugin SIA to Tegla.exe you will find a new plugin where you can specify the file name below to the file you have just created and immediately you get some information about layers, materials, cross-sections, number of nodes and the number of beams which are exported. A very basic principle in this SIA to Tecla link is the use of mapping databases. Mapping databases are used to cross-reference cross-sections and materials from SIA to Tecla. There are a number of databases already available by default in the software, but you can also use the Mapping Database Editor to add your own cross-sections or materials. If we open the basic Eurocode EN cross-section database, you will find, for instance, a hash E100A or, in our case, hash E240A, <coughs> which is linked to the hash EA240 in Tecla structures. The same philosophy applies to the materials, whereas in CI Engineer there is only S235 and in Tecla Structures there is a S235GO. Let's get back to the plugin. Once you have set the mapping databases and specified the file, the only thing you have to do is load the data in Tecla Structures. Now the plugin works in a very specific way. You need to have Tecla Structures open in a new empty project as the plugin will look for the Tecla process and link it. Once you click the button load data into Tecla Structures, you will see that the materials are cross-referenced, the cross-sections, and if you switch back to Tecla Structures, you will see the same model as in CI Engineer appear in the cluster.